Now, your KSBW weather forecast with meteorologist Art Jarrett. Well, good morning to you. I'm going to start you out again over in Santa Cruz right now, holding on to some mist and drizzle out there. A deep and marine layer of about 3,000 feet. So again, that's a slow clearing out of our interior valleys today. 94% relative humidity, so it feels muggy out there. In fact, 58 degrees, even though it feels like 58, it shows that the winds are light. You get into the inland side, we're already holding on to 60s there. We're even doing the same in Monterey at 61 degrees. Now, working from Monterey back into Salinas, you'll see mist and drizzle. By the time you get halfway to uh, Salinas, say just around uh, WeatherTech uh, Laguna Seca, you're going to start to dry it out a bit. Then you'll pick up more of the low cloud activity right down through the valley, getting into King City and beyond to the south. We also have widespread fog, low cloud activity all the way into Hollister, getting up into the foothills by Pacheco Pass. And then again, you get up in the Santa Cruz Mountains, we've got 3,000 feet, so that is affecting the areas up by the summit again, holding on to some cloud cover there. And then that extends all the way to coastal San Mateo County. So if you are doing some driving back home after you're leaving uh, the, uh, the, uh, the last few days of uh, car week and you're heading up the coastline. You want to be careful. There's going to be mist and drizzle out there. You'll pick up uh, some mist and drizzle as you can see some of the local areas by Carmel Valley. So starting your morning, uh, be careful out there. And the same will pr probably happen in Morgan Hill over by the foothills there to the west. In fact, you get into satellite imagery. We'll pick up some high clouds today. So mostly sunny skies for the interior valley. You see them drifting in all the way into Redding. And then another cold front will sweep by again as we go through today and then into uh, Tuesday and Wednesday. That'll begin to cool us down. There is one right now that is keeping our, our temperatures fairly cool. High pressure slides down along the coastline, so you're going to see wind south of the Monterey Bay picking up a little speed. We'll also get into the uh, another uh, cold front sweeping into uh, northern California as well as into the Gulf of Alaska, and that's going to continue to keep our temperatures cool briefly. And then we'll get into the warming. You're going to see 93 in Fresno, 89 in Sacramento, but look as we go into tomorrow, you'll get to 95 in Fresno and 91 in Sacramento. So warming will happen eventually. You get into the temperatures from 65 to 72 degrees today on the coastal side, and then some patchy bay fog will linger. 72 to 82 degrees for the uh, inland side today. Your KSPW eight day forecast will take you into slightly warmer conditions, even though we have mostly cloudy skies for Tuesday and Wednesday. Santa Cruz will get some sunshine out of that and we'll continue to warm you up as we go into Thursday, Friday, Saturday and Sunday. Temperatures are above seasonal averages on the inland side. Ooh, there we go. 70s, 80s, 90s return on Wednesday. Even with the added cloud cover, we'll get into temperatures getting into the 80s and 90s, continuing right into your weekend. Then we dip it down and bring it right back up again. Right. There's okay. a lot going on there with all these cold yeah, fronts kind of moving by. There's like three or four of them coming and going. You're a busy man. <laughs> <laughs> Not really. <laughs> all right, thank okay. you.